Welcome, my name's Cookie. Or is that the first lie? No, it's not. I'm Cookie. Okay, see, this game is going to be between you, 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 and you. Sounds like a good one. Oh, and if anybody else wants to join, they can get in the audience at any time. Audience people can play along for their own personal scores and can like their favorite lie each question. Let's do this. <laughs> This is round one. You'll get 500 points for everyone you fool. And you'll get a thousand for finding the truth. And you've got a defibrillator. Use it to remove all but one lie and the truth. And just one defibbing per game. Select a category. Okay, here's your first question. Indian native Budhia Singh has the claim to fame of being the youngest person to blank at the age of three. Now use your device to type a lie that might fool the other players into believing it. If you can't think of anything in time, use the lie for me button for half the points. Do it now. if you can't think of anything. Okay, now find the truth and enter it on your device.
Let's see what everybody selected. Well, you guys blew it. <laughs> this kid finished 48 marathons by age four. Most people don't finish 48 marathons until middle school. And that means some of these didn't get picked. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. In 2015, the University of Pikeville, a small liberal arts college in Kentucky, announced that it will make blank an official sport. Enter your lies now. If you can't think of something. Okay, take a look and find the truth. Okay, what did everyone pick? <laughs> National Signing Day is held in a mother's basement. And that means... Time to pick a category. No, 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 that's okay, I've got it. Okay, here's the question. In Arizona, you must obtain permit 3-2664 if you want to feed blank to pigs. Type in your lies now. if you can't think of anything. Alright, where's the truth? Okay, let's take a look. Ah! 
And the rest of the board goes unselected. Now it's round two, where all point values are doubled. And remember to use your defibrillator if you need a little jolt of help. Use it in round two or lose it. Select the category. It's not hard. You know what, we'll just stick with this one. Okay, here's the question. A teenager riding virgin trains was able to tweet at the rail company while he was on board in order to get blank delivered to him by a staff member. Input your lies now. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Who picked what? <laughs> and we're done. Pick a category. Okay, here's the question. When police in Olympia, Washington apprehended a robber of a Subway restaurant in early 2015, they were amused when they found that among his robbery supplies was a blank. Write your lies now. Okay, where's the truth? Let's see what everybody picked. Police were confused as to how he had escaped Dick Tracy all these years. And that's it. Nobody else's lives got picked. Uh -huh. 
Select a category. Okay, here's the question. U.S. Code Title 15, Chapter 29, Section 1244 makes an exception for carrying a switchblade knife. It is legal so long as the blade is less than three inches long and the person carrying it blank. Type in your lies now. button if you can't think of something. Okay, which one's the truth? Okay, what did everyone pick? As if Richard Kimball's hunt for the one-armed man wasn't dangerous enough. And that's it. Welcome to the final fibbage. This is your final question, and it's worth triple. It's anybody's game. Okay, here is your final fibbage question. The unusual thing that jazz musician Bill Wharton is known for having on stage during his concerts. Enter your lies now. Okay, find the truth. Who picked what? Okay, well, you all dropped the ball. And the rest of these lies didn't fool a soul.
Hi, I'm Cookie and this is Fibbage. Do you like to party? Just curious. Five players. Take that, Candyland. Two to four players. Weak. Oh, and anyone else who wants to get in can be in the audience. You can play along for your own personal score and vote for your favorite lies. Let's do this. <laughs> This is round one, and that means you get 500 points for everyone you fool with your made-up answer. And you'll get a thousand for finding the truth. And everyone gets a defibrillator, which removes all but two answers on any question. Save it for a tough one. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's your first question. Because it was thought to impair one's eyesight, Russian leaders in the early 20th century banned people from blank. Input your lies now. Okay, here are your choices.
Okay, let's take a look. Wow, that was one hell of a lie. A hell of a lie. Well, don't you feel foolish. And nobody picked any of these other lies. Select a category. Okay, here's the question. Detective Eric Shepard of Klamath County, Oregon, investigated a rather bizarre case in February 2015. A local property owner had strangely had his blank stolen. Type in your lies now. Okay, there's a truth out there. Find it. Let's see what everybody selected. And nobody thought to question the suspiciously fat beavers. And nobody fell for some of these ingenious lies. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. 16 years after it went missing, Lena Paulson miraculously found her wedding ring hiding on a blank. Enter your lies now. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Okay, what did everyone pick? Oh, women, they'll do anything to get an extra carrot on their diamond. And nobody picked the other lies up there. This is round two, which means all point values are doubled. And don't forget to use that defibrillator if you haven't already. It's gone after round two. Select a category. Okay, here's the question. 
On the tiny Canary Island of La Gomera, an ancient indigenous language is making a comeback. The language is unusual because it is communicated entirely via blank. Write your lies now. Okay, take a look and find the truth. Okay, let's take a look. So when you arrive, make sure you get an English to dictionary. And these incredible bluffs somehow went unselected. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's the question. In early 2015, a 91-year-old woman in Quebec was given a $148 fine because her blank was too loud. Input your lies now. Okay, which one's the truth? Alright, let's see what everybody picked. <laughs> now, before you scoff, it was one of those souped-up rocking chairs with the loud mufflers and the flames down the armrest. And we're done. All right, pick a category. Road trip time. Let's take a road trip. When driving through Lexington, Kentucky, be sure to stop at the Lexington Ice and Recreation Center and have a ball by playing some blank themed mini golf. Type in your lies now. Where's the truth? All right, who picked what?
And that means... You're about to enter the final fibbage. Just one final question and it's worth triple. Good luck. Take a look at your final fibbage question. The name of the nachos served at celebrity chef Guy Fieri's restaurant in New York City. Enter your lies now. Okay, find the truth. Okay, what did everyone pick? And that's it.